All right, Matthew. What is life like it's now? It's Matt. Matt, sorry. <laughs> Why is that funny? Uh, we are in the south side of Pittsburgh, and uh, we're gonna see who their favorite comedian is. Obviously, it's gonna be me. Uh, and how popular I am and how much people love me in this city. So let's go out and see why uh, I got this. Excuse me, can I ask you a few questions? What? Okay, so who, uh, how often do you watch comedy, comedy shows? Not when they Okay. With comedy, if you had the Super Bowl of jokes, okay, I'm not the Buffalo Bills, okay, I'm not the Minnesota Vikings, I'm the Pittsburgh Steelers of comedy, pre-Tomlin, like when they were good, you know, they didn't have a black coach. But the thing is, there's no Rooney rule in voting, that's why I won. Is this gonna be on TV? This is, this is gonna be on 60 Minutes. The 60 Minutes? 60 Minutes. So we're gonna do that. Being best of the Berg, uh, you know, now, now I have a, you know, a chip on my shoulder and everybody's thinking, oh, what's Matt gonna do next? What's the next step? It's like, this is the big step. I mean, being the best in Pittsburgh at comedy is phenomenal. I'm the best comedian in the whole city. Who's your favorite comedian from Pittsburgh? Uh, I think his name is Mike. He Mike. Has dark hair. Dark. Big guy. Big guy. That's all I remember. It's going to be <laughs> Sassen, really yeah, loud. Yeah, yeah. Mike yeah. Sassen. There you go. <sighs> now. I mean, you don't understand, like, I'm getting phone calls at least once or twice every three months to do these shows, man. And, like, I did the show at the VFW. It was so awesome. They even, I got paid for it. I got, I got a case and a half of Keystone Light, which is phenomenal. Top ten of my favorite beers. Who's your favorite comedian from Pittsburgh? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I have a lot of articles. This one was the best of the Berg magazine, where they list all the, the best things. I'm an elite class, um, you know, there's me, there's the best dog groomer in Bethel Park, Mutts and Cuts, which is fantastic. I mean, they, they should be in France, the stuff that they can do with the, the poodle's hairs. Who's your favorite comedian? Oh, uh, I don't know. You Jim don't know? Carey, Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey? I love Robin Williams. Robin Williams, okay, he's, he's doing well. He just oh. passed last week. Oh, wow. Yeah, he just committed suicide. Oh. Yeah. The, the first, um, Time I was in a newspaper was for this, which was pretty exciting. Um, my article's right here. I talk about how baseball's suddenly getting serious in the city again. So they interviewed Pittsburgh comedians on what they thought about baseball. But when I went to Family Dollar, they had a problem framing this. I don't know if it's too big or they just don't like baseball there. No, I need some material. All right. <laughs> what did Jesus say when he made the first black person? Nothing, because God's not real. No, because oh. he said, whoops, I burnt that one. So oh, that one. okay. <laughs> Can I use that? Yeah, go ahead. Why can't I use that? I'm black. <laughs> We're both, he don't care. Fuck it. So is he black? So he yeah, can use it. Have had, so he, I, can, I get that so you can't you. finish the punchline. He has to finish the punchline. Yeah, he gets the punch. you know, Every year we do a, uh, a comedian's football game. It's called the Super Bowl. And the, the best of the best, I mean, you should see the athletes that play this. They probably all played college ball. Anyways, last year, I won um, MVP of the game, where it was pretty interesting. This is actually a replica of me catching the ball, um, but because I, I run so fast, they put wings on me, um, and they even put my man boobs on. Whatever, it's fine. There was a piece here uh, that had a big football, but um, I, I gave it to some kid that was watching us playing home. So I try to give back to the community as much as I can. Why did the chicken cross the road? Why did he cross the road? To get to the other side. Can I use that? Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. You wrote that? I wrote it myself. Awesome. I'm going to use that. Thank you so much. Yeah, Have a good one. A big thing that happened was when I was diagnosed with cancer. So um, I felt like it was a good thing to give back to the community and trying to you know, do as many charity shows as I can. Um, but sometimes I can't do shows, so I just go donate. I donate to my local Rivers Casino. And um, you know I play blackjack for the kids. And if I don't win, at least I know there's going to be a swing set built somewhere in the North Shore one of these days. Do you have any? Do you have any good jokes? Gene Tracy. Gene Tracy's a good joke. You know, it's cool because ever since I won, everyone's real respectful now. Um, you know, like when I got cancer and when I won the awards, everyone said that I deserved both of them, which was pretty exciting. Uh. I think I'm gonna win again next year by this, so thanks.
and we just kept walking. And they were like, hey, queers. And I was like, maybe. We should stop holding hands. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>